And after Election Day yesterday, the next big race is for the mayor of Chicago. Anthony Ponce joins us live from the newsroom as the political cycle begins again. Anthony. <laughs> Donna Corey, yeah, no time to catch our breaths after the <laughs> midterm election. Chicago's mayoral race about to kick into high gear with two major names, local names, expected to announce in the coming days. And one big endorsement earlier today, progressive candidate Brandon Johnson, a county commissioner, scored another major endorsement from organized labor. SEIU Local 73 represents presenting 16,000 Chicago workers, throwing its support behind Johnson, who's already secured the endorsement of the Chicago Teachers Union. We believe Brandon is the most progressive candidate who will unite a multiracial class coalition of Chicago citizens. For too long, the voices and the cries of working people have gone unheard and unnoticed. But let me make this very clear today. As the next mayor of the city of Chicago, the cries and the voices of working people will no longer be ignored. Uh, that endorsement coming the day before Jesus Chuy Garcia, fresh off winning re-election for Congress, is expected to announce his candidacy for mayor. And then prominent Northside Alderman Tom Tunney expected to announce his candidacy on Monday. Sally?